posting my friend earlier today about how fucking busy I've been. Basically for the past two months, I started a new job and I've had class and oh, it's just like a lot to keep up with. And I've also been keeping up with like social media on top of that, cause that's another job of mine. But it's also like the biggest creative outlet in my life. And something that I've learned over the past couple of months is that you really have to like budget your time and energy so that you don't like run yourself into the ground. I have this whole self-care routine that I haven't been able to keep up with because I've literally been so fucking tired and like when I get home at the end of the day of literally going to class and then going to work right after I am just way too exhausted to keep up with my self-care routine and that's scary it's really fucking scary because I don't want to lose sight of it and I don't want to stop caring about it because that self-care routine that I've like built for myself is literally why I think I'm like in the best place mentally right now than I have been in like years. From my gratitude journal, today's quote of the day is The, the creation, creation of, of a thousand, thousand forests is in one acorn. I think you could do a lot with that information. First of all, think about it like a journey starts with one step. There was this other quote that I learned the other day that was like, if you want to make the world a better place, start with making yourself a better person. And I think that's like a pretty good quote. Like that is what I think like this quote of the day also means basically just like start somewhere you know and build off of that foundation it's that simple i made tea i've made better tea let's just say that but i want to go to like a tea store or something and get like a really good tea and be like a tea like girly anyway like i was saying though and i think it's really reflecting in my content too like i don't know just for some reason recently these past three weeks videos have just been like so much easier to make because i'm putting so much less pressure on myself i'm learning so many life lessons it's like i'm like kind of teaching myself like a lot of things i've just been kind of in a good place yeah i don't want to like lose this good place even though I know life is ever changing and nothing stays the same and you know where there are highs there are gonna be lows so I want to do everything I can to prevent those lows is what I'm trying to say and I've been on top of my self-care routine but I'm looking at my tracker thing I like made a list of things that I want to keep up with in my routine and for the past three nights I have not been doing my self-care routine so I can't let that go on for a fourth night. I just can't. So cheers to um, keeping up with your mental health. Cheers. I said this about three videos ago and I'll say it again. I will fight the elderly. Like I don't give a fuck. So I made a community post a couple of days ago promoting my last video and someone commented on it saying that their grandma motherfucking, they showed their grandma my video and she said it was stupid. <laughs> Hey, random person's grandma. So what did you say about my YouTube video? I said it was stupid and that you're a black fucking- Oh no, the pink police are here. What the fuck happened here? Like, why is there someone's random grandma on the ground? She called my YouTube video stupid, so I hit her in the face with my shovel. Why would she say that about your video? You're the baddest. I don't know. That's why I hit her in the face with my shovel, because I thought maybe it would help her realize that I'm the baddest and like- No, you honestly would, don't um, even have to explain yourself. Like, she's a fucking dumb bitch and she deserves to fucking- Bitch, let me see that. So you just like go I'll Call my video stupid one more time Your video was fucking stupid <laughs>
Besties, I have come to a bit of a realization about my routine. So earlier today, I was taking a drive around town and I was listening to a podcast, Radio Headspace, and there was an episode about different types of rest. And I realized that the reason that I've been kind of slacking on my journaling type like routine is because that's not the type of rest that like my body needs the most right now. Let's go over the different types of rest. Physical rest, which you need when you've been doing a lot of physical activity and your body is like super fucking tired. That's the type of rest that I literally need right now. Then there's creative rest, which is something that I think a lot of like artists or like creators on the internet can benefit greatly from, you know, exerting yourself too much creatively and you're a little bit burnt out and you need to take a little walk in nature or go to a museum or start consuming beauty instead of always producing it. I don't really need creative rest right now. I took basically a creative rest like back in October and I'm like good on that aspect of besties. Then there's a mental rest, which is what my journaling habits are basically good for. It's good for like getting out your thoughts and like expressing what's on your mind in a healthy way. I'm like doing good on that regard. So my body is like, bitch, put a pause on that right now and get some like physical rest. Like I'm literally tired. Then there's social rest rest which basically means like you've been socializing too much or maybe your social group or circle is a little bit toxic and you need to like switch it up a little bit and last but not least there's spiritual rest which just means like you need a little refresher on like what's the meaning of your life or like what's your purpose in life or what's your direction that you want to go in life i just kind of wanted to let you guys know because i know at the beginning of this video i was talking about how i was losing track of my like journaling routine and i don't know why i literally don't feel like doing it anymore and it's because my body requires a different type of rest and i'm really glad i listened to that podcast earlier because i was starting to like worry and like beat myself up a little bit as to why i wasn't so engaged in my usual routine it's just because i need to like relax a little bit i've been doing like yoga in the mornings and tell me why it's hard as fuck those yoga bitches be fucking going like damn damn they didn't tell me it was gonna be like this like oh uh, like I've never done anything with like fire before. So I was listening to Burn by Georgia Smith and it just like really resonated with me. So I wanted to make this little gray zombie guy on fire. I was at work yesterday and I got recognized like five times. People like get nervous to walk up to me because the people who did walk up to me were like so nervous. I was like, why are you nervous? Like, come say hi. This clip is only going in the video to say, if you see me in public, don't be afraid to say hi. Like I was in my fame era. Like I was like, bitch. someone was like, oh my God, hi. And I was like, you're like the fifth person today. And they were like only five only five should i should it be hundreds like what's going on well i hope you guys enjoyed today's video make sure to give it a thumbs up and comment down below and subscribe if you're new here and turn on post notifications so that you never miss an upload bitch i hope you guys have been liking my videos recently i feel like i've been on like a good streak
Like, you know, I don't know. Do you agree? Like, I don't know. Let me know if you agree. Cause I feel like my videos lately, like I've just been like so happy with them. Like, okay, so I've been using this mouthwash. It's been burning my mouth. Like my mouth is burning. It hurts to talk. Like I'm in pain right now. I'm hurting. Please feel bad for me. Please give me cases. Um, have a good day today. Batty group, comment batty group if you made it this far in the video. Hey batty group, um, look at this funny situation that we're in right now. My mouth hurts, it hurts. Like, I feel like I can't even concentrate on like what I'm trying to say because my mouth hurts so bad. I'll catch you in the next video. Goodbye. Um.